okay welcome back guys it's your body go graphics today as you can see you might be looking at this that uh, what am i up to this time around i want to teach you how to edit this image you can see this uh naturally camera image uh it uh, has a lot of pimples a lot of contour how can we make this image brighter more clearer and uh, more presentable like a professional using your android smartphone so without wasting much of our time let's get started in order to achieve this i'm going to introduce you into uh, basically let's say three applications for now uh, we are going to make use of lightroom application which is an amazing application we are going to make use of uh, uh, ea application as well then we are going to make use of uh, PSAT. so without wasting much of our time let's get started so let's go to our lightroom application so when you turn on the Lightroom application, you will have an interface to be like this. And when you open for the first time, you download that you need to register. After registration, then you see something like this. To a hard image or use any present, I'm going to walk you through this. You had an image, you bring it like this. Then you locate where you have the image. You can see some amazing work I've done with this application. So I'm going to access... Uh, my phone gallery that is where i am so i want to go to the whatsapp stuff where i can select and bring this to the board so this is the image i'm talking about so now having the image i've added the image anywhere so i'm going to bring this image up so and as you can see this is the image so there are two things involved is either i use this as the first or i later come and use this but let's try first whether it can work with a preset so i want to use a preset which is my own you can use any of the recommended presets here we have a premium preset that come along with the application itself and this is the recommended one but when you look at all these presets they are not uh, so we shall text whether this can work amazingly and when you look at it the contour there, the pimples and everything is not disappear. We shows that uh, we can use this. But in order to make this one work, we can still apply and do some other things. But instead of that, I prefer a hair brush application before I will use my Lightroom. So let's go to hair brush application. It's one of the amazing applications as well. So we'll go to our library and we we'll select it directly. Then let's use a uh, it has a preset as well which come along with it but you can see by turning on the magic you can see automatically this thing is removing little by little so now i've done something with this i will go to the i don't need to uh edit the face i what i like it the chin i don't need it the nose is okay the lips i want to see whether i can change the li lips is okay i don't want it to be too long the red eyes is not there the ticks i need to whiten the teeth is on already so the skin tone i don't need to touch something like that okay i don't need to so uh, uh let me on it again so which means i need to click okay so after that i have to go to the tools since i've done something with magic or go to the smooth so getting to the most smooth smooth will help me to do the normal stuff or go to the magic so magic will help me and you can see this thing is uh removing gradually so i can reduce the uh, reduce it anyway a little bit and this is cool okay reduce it uh, and this is cool so after that i will click okay go to acne is there any so if there is any acne you can use automatic depends on your choice go to the foundation if you want to add some foundation, you can add it and everything will be cool. But I don't want to add the foundation. This texture, let's see how the texture will look. So if you want the texture to be added or you want to add it automatically. But I don't prefer that. So once you are, one thing about the editing, as you are, uh, edit, are on tap on anything, you make sure that uh, you are checking the picture. For you to see how it look okay so let's look at this when we select it automatically or uh, when we reduce the, the details when we had the details a little bit we shall see how it work so we click okay what about the highlighter 
I like uh, whether we can add something to do with that. And this is amazing as well. You can reduce a bit. Let's go to meter. Okay. Uh, uh, is this okay? I don't need this contour. Okay. So we we'll put that one on the cheeks. So, and you can see how it look when you had it. It make it uh, look more presentable. We don't need on forehead. What about the eye? Eye. So how do you want your eye to be? If you want the eyelashes, okay. What about the high brow? Okay, make it more darker. And then we got to think. What about the lips? So the lips we can adjust that a little bit. So after that, the white it. Okay, let's check the white it. And uh, things is cool like this. Okay, so we click OK. Align. What about the high risk? We don't want to do anything with that. What about the brightening? So when I get the highs, it's okay the way it was before. We don't want any that cycle. It's okay. So now let's go to the two. So when we go to the two, we can look at when we have a relight. Let's look at the relight. We can adjust something there. So looking at the relight, this is cool, right? So and we can reduce the size a bit. And I guess this is cool. So now go to, uh, let's look at the enhance. So yeah, we can adjust the sharp, the sharpness a little bit. We don't need it. Let's look at the saturation. Saturation, a light, reduce a bit. Okay. When you increase, you can see yourself. So the shadow, you can reduce to bring out the beauty. So the brightness is okay. We don't need to add the temperature. So that is cool, right? So the prism, let's look at it. I guess it's okay. Let's look at the filter. We don't need that. The makeup. So when you look at the makeup, we can tell and that this is cool, right? When you look at that, or we select this, or this, okay? Or we use this. Anyone depends. But you have to be considering some facts. Look at the lips, okay? So if we select this actually, or this, or we look at uh, this, so you can reduce, okay? Reduce it a little bit so that it's not be too much. Or you select this and reduce a bit. It depends on your choice. Or we select this and reduce a bit. So after that, let's look at the lips. The lips is okay. The blush, I guess I don't need that. The contouring, so let's look at it. It's okay. Eyebrow, I guess it's okay. Eyelashes, it's there before because we can still change. It depends. Okay, none. So eyeliner, eye shadow. I get eye shadow should we should hard a little to make it okay. Eye color, we don't need that. So after that, we go to the hair, creative. So this is where we can change our background. If you actually want to change the backgrounds, okay? So we have different kind of a background here which we can use, okay? To be, you can see, we can select or use this. We can use this, as you can see. So we have a lot of background which you can switch to. So you can see another one, So which I, I even love to prefer this. Okay, if I don't see any better one, I would rather go for that. And you can make use of this or make use of this. But I guess I will go for the previous one. Even if you go for this, it won't be as perfect as the previous one, which I've seen there. So look for this. And this is cool. So after that, the next thing I'm still thinking, you can have a add this uh star into it you can have this star particle like this and you reduce it a bit okay reduce it just like this after that after that you can click okay so now after this we are done with the first staff so you have your work being saved now let's go back to uh our our Lightroom application. So we are going to add 
stuff like this so let's just go in there we are going to hard stuff this is on camera we have well, this is what we just edited okay you can tell see the differences so go to the present then we have the present to be changed then look at it amazing right and you can adjust the present as well it depends on your choice you can have it adjusted it depends but before we we'll bring that here and that's what i said depends on the mood of the picture you can quickly go to your snap seed when you go to the snap seed bring in the that particular image okay i believe we are not making more take more times so under 10 minutes so after that you go to the portrait directly the portrait will give you good stuff okay so why we are going to uh, make this the face to be okay so the smooth everything seems to be smooth i will make the height to be sharper to be sharper as well just a little bit the skin smooth let's say 25 the face not much too okay so good so now what we are going to do next when we look at it uh, this is right right so we can go to details so i want to sorry i want to go to details so when you go to details you can not structure so go to even the sharp sorry so when you sharp it you can tell you can see how the result will be so we can add uh, a little bit let's add a saturation a bit to change the whole stuff so now have your work being saved so we can now go back to the lightroom so to add if we can want to add uh, and you can see not this okay so we come back so when we back we had now automatically so let's look at it this is camera so i want to see the snap set is what i'm looking for okay snap set okay and this is it so you have to put uh, in your mind the location of that particular stuff you are looking for and you can see even without adding the preset and how can we add the preset now so you have the variety of presets here you can be tapping it and be adding it and when you are adding you can just make sure that you are reducing the, uh, the hardness so that at least you get the accurate result and everything will sharp just exactly or as perfect as perfect and if you don't want that you can just remove that scroll and check for more so when you select this you see the result you get so you can still look for more when you select this you see the result you check when you select this you see the result you check so this is how you are going to be so for it until when you are able to get the authentic one of your choice you can see these are the custom uh no it's not a cost it's a custom font anyway of your choice i got it so i'm thinking i'm still skeptical about what you choose anyway but i know i'll finally find one so i think uh the beauty i have a phone called beauty so this is beauty and i guess i can use this but too sharp right so you can reduce so that it will not even show you can reduce and if you don't want that we can still come to the recommended one recommended one we we study the skin and give you what it uh, can work for it so and you can see how the recommended one look so you can decide to use that actually if you prefer and that one will give you the good stuff so now this is how the recommended one be and i believe this is cool right so the last one not the least but if you want to use your own choice there is nothing wrong with that you can use the one of your choice and uh, nothing wrong with it okay so look at this if you want to use this and this is how the result will be if you want to use a glamour effort this is how it will be and when you use them you can reduce 
the hardness for you to get a better result so and after this uh, because of the nature of the image i'm going to show you what you are going to do next but there is something that we did here that we supposed not to do okay so let us zoom our eye back here so i need to just remove this particular stuff okay so after removing it i will quickly go back because i will tell you why i think we should do that so go to the hair brush back you know this one don't have anything so apply the previous uh, or editing save again and you go to your lightroom the light sparkle which i had it so it uh it's affecting when i apply the preset on the lightroom so it affects the stuff so that is why so now we re-add it so after re-adding it so now you see this one does not have any containers or particle okay so now what i will do next is uh i will just uh, go and add and later i will add what i want there so i just want something that will be natural anyway i want a natural stuff natural something natural so this number 10 i guess this should be natural so i will reduce very well reduce it very well then i will check it very well so after that i will click ok so when i'm able to do that what i need to do next is to go to auto so this is not right just click on back and uh, we will now go to add some details so the sharpening i will look at that how it occur okay then uh, look at the details the details should be reduced a bit okay uh not so reduction so i don't want any noise there so go to i mean the sharpening the details should be increased okay a bit and this is making sense color reduction a bit perfect the smoothness is okay anyway it can increase a bit so now that you have this stuff is okay so we need to just back so now what we are going to do next after that click on the preset when you tap on the preset click on back and you scroll down go to optics when you go to optics you select the lens and see a correction for you to be able to see the height clearly then you click on the sharpening again and let it be a uh, light or you make it to be heavy or light is okay or make it to be medium so this is okay now we are done with everything click on three line dot save a copy okay then we are good to go what else do we need to do you can go to either photo tone just to remove the blurriness or whatever if you want or you feel you want it more sharply you can tap on this you can see the difference between the lightroom and this click ok click on enhance you can still enhance the image to bring out the work and when you look at it this is the previous work and this is the enhanced one you can tell fix the blurriness now so when you face the blurriness you can see how the thing come out amazingly so i believe we'll learn something from here so let's see the result so go to here you can see look at it right okay fine so let's look at the result now photo fix and this is the exact uh what we're able to come out with so thanks for watching god bless you